All right, guys, at the grandparents' house. Let's see. Let's see. It's Saturday morning. Can we get Silver Lake on the GPS here? Well, it's right there, but it is not turning blue. Well, believe me, there's a lake over there. Also, by the looks of things, we have a very dirty lens. Oh, yeah. Let's clean that up. Hmm. Is that better? Oh, yeah. I'd say it is. I even get a garage spot today. Check this out. Beautiful 76 degrees this morning. Not bad, not bad. There are two raindrops on the windshield, so... <laughs> We're going to put uh, 16 cylinders in that garage again. Oh, God. Oh god, it must be Saturday. Uh oh. Okay. Keyless entry works even though I have a key. I think every single Saturday. The vlog starts about now, though I already have filmed clips. You'll see this ridiculous cold idle of 1500 RPM. Right there. Which is, it's actually more than 1500 when it starts up. Like, my foot is totally off the throttle, I'll tell you when. It's off. And it still keeps revving, and look how slowly it comes down. This thing is so weird. It's been totally, uh, optimized or whatever. For, um, I guess efficient driving with this engine. And there's the smart car. <laughs> that is a cool feature. I, I love that. And it's over here. You can actually turn it off or on. There's off. Then when you turn it on, you get a little deep little picture of the car there with all your stuff on it. And uh, he's going to pull the smart car in, I would speculate. Yep. Okay. Let's do a little tour of the Hyundai here. We'll push to accept on that. He's got the XM on the 40 station. I'm going to bump it up 30 years. Get to the 70s on 7. Boom, there we go. Alright, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Info, we gotta turn this around on every time. Wait a minute. XM, menu. Damn it. How does this work? I don't really even know. Hold on, I'll find it. There we go. Turn this around on. And now that sounds okay. Sweet. This is a lexicon sound system with a crap ton of speakers. They are everywhere. Every single Saturday. I swear. Cuyahoga Valley this time. Not the Welcome to the set today. And oh my god, there's a blue patch. Holy crap. Alright, guys, check it out. There's that other M5. Black E39 EQZ license plate. I don't know if I've seen that around town. I've definitely seen the car parked at the house there before, though. So that's cool to see. I usually see that black M5 around. Um, actually, I've seen it in Hudson once like two years ago, and then sometimes here in the summer. So, yeah, sweet. I'm leaving early so I can go back and mow. We're not going to the pool because it's supposed to rain as usual. So I'm gonna get the car home before it does choose to rain. Uh, it's 1.46, I'll be home by two-ish. We'll cut some grass and then move on with the plans for the evening. All right, singing along to Michael Buble. <laughs> Uh, past me, I'm on 303, headed into town. Going west was a silver Ferrari 360 Challenge Stradale, the CS, with the stripes down the middle. I'm not a fan of that car, but it's rare you see him. So I'm thinking that's Buddy Kim in his 360 CS today at 154 on 303. That's pretty cool. Nice to see a Ferrari again. And listen to that. Oh, yeah. Sumptuous. Just about 5.45, I got home, I don't even know when, but I went over and mowed across the street. It sucked. It really, really sucked. Over there. It's done. And it took like two hours, and the, the dew point out here is 70. The temperature's only about 88 or so. Only 88. 
uh, it's really, really uncomfortable. It's one of those air conditioning days. And I'll unlock the car, but I'm not putting windows down. All right, so check this out. I just actually filmed this. Um, that's a broken halogen light that will be replaced tonight. And that's an LED light, which I just put in. I'm leaving that one in right now because I want to see a comparison at night. So stay tuned on E39, of course. We'll have that video up shortly. Anyways, I'm going to head over to Gardner's now, water some flowers, and then probably head over to Brad's tonight, and I don't know what we're doing yet, so you'll see. So I think July 6th is apparently Hudson Car Day now. Three cars apart, there's that red 930 turbo, maybe it's not a, thir a, tur a turbo, but it's that license plate DM911, I filmed it all the time, it's a late 80s, early 90s 911, it's beautiful. Behind that was the white Audi R8 that I filmed a few times, the V10, and we saw that 360 CS earlier, at least I did, I'm sorry, I haven't been able to film any of it for you, I'm 0 for 3 so far. But it's okay, there's a Lexus ES up there, and a Chevy Trailblazer. Nice. Well, guys, there's bad news at KSFO. You've probably heard I was just there three weeks ago, so that's kind of interesting to see. Boeing 777 from uh, South Korea. Looks like it came in a little low, hit the seawall, and that jacked the landing up. So. Incident uh, or crash involving this particular airline. Uh, hmm. The company was found. Sounds like a bad airline. All right. Um, I'm home now. I'm just having some leftover dinner from last night and some grapes. Those are freezing and they're excellent. We've got Weedables going on, a breadstick, another half a breadstick, and I just had my pizza. So it's 6 30. Razvan's going to come over around 7 and we'll go from there. Guys, it's a car day. Check it out. That's an M3 with halos, E46. Oh, that is beautiful. Oh. Sorry, I'm nerding out on you. That was that. Was, what do you think? That was good news. That was good news right there. Yeah, All right, good. it is 7:30. We're headed over to Brad's house. K band. Oh <laughs> no. Oh uh, yeah. Oh, All right, no. we're close to Brad's. Just went through town. The M3 was, I think, the only car of interest. Happy Saturday. What's up, guys? I feel like I do this every week. I didn't film at Brad's. Sorry. It's 11:30. I'm home. License plate lights are done. I just finished the E39 source video, so I thought I'd show you. If you didn't know, I don't remember if I explained before or not, but I replaced my license plate lights with the LEDs uh, as per several requests from E39 source viewers. Excuse Abba. We'll flip to pause one. Look at the shadow for one. Very bright. Um, I don't think it's ridiculously bright. It actually makes the car look, I think, a lot newer. Uh, being a white color instead of a very, very, very dim yellow, it's now a bright 6000K kind of color. So it matches more uh, with uh, updated tail lights and of course the headlights. So I think I'm pretty happy with that. <laughs> lights are off. It's that time of the night, 1.40 a.m. I'm going up to bed. Talk to you guys tomorrow on Sunday. Good night.